Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of my time at Porsche here on Not Your Professional Walkthroughs channel with me, your host Max. So currently we are still looking at the spring season and until tomorrow we have access to the mine. Then we're going to have to pay additional 80 gold in order to gain access into it. And in a couple of days, we're going to have like a fishing day or a fishing event. So I'm hoping we're going to get something decent out of that. Other than that, we have kind of invested certain points into our skills or how much experience we gain. That is why we are now at level 10. We also have points invested into the reduction of the overall mastery of our uh, axe or pickaxe. So the reduction is in the uh, stamina points. And we should also try to invest into some of the social skills. So increase the workshop points by one and the rewards by 5% after completing each commission and things like that. That would be really awesome. So we're going to see what can we do do in that specific department the gift giver or just the smooth talker would be really nice so there is lots of ways you can customize your character here now when it comes to the missions currently we are looking to uh, build the bridge to the amber island then there is the farmer where we need to harvest the crops which we received and after that there's the fixing of the fence we still have 12 days to do so but we were low on wood so i wasn't really able to make the wooden planks and i don't know if it's hardwood or if it's wood that we need right now so i need to check it looks just like the wooden board so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make more of them if possible we are gonna have to fetch some wood some serious quantity of wood but we are running low on resources here it takes a couple of days for the trees to regrow here so whatever it is that i chop down here it's gonna take a while for it to respawn and we really need to get our hands on upgrade two boxes from one of the shops the unfortunate thing is that they are not the cheapest thing in the world so we're, we're gonna have to consider our options there also on our last run in the mines we came across this book called structural dimensions theory and i'm not really sure if we can drop this off at the research center or what can be done with it so we're gonna have to see what can actually be done with it is there anything else which i can chop down without being forced to go super far away if I eliminate all of the woods close to me, then it's going to be kind of annoying to try and fetch more of that stuff. But we're going to have to do what we got to do. And we're going to have to go into the mines in order to fetch more data disks. As we require at least five of them in order to uh, start the research. Eventually it might be even more. I'm not really sure. Uh, I haven't played this thing in quite a while, so... If you have any advice for me, let me know. I will be more than happy to read about it. I am accidentally hitting the poor llama or the alpaca behind. So we're gonna get rid of this little bugger. We're gonna pick up the animal poop because we will need it for the planters. Maybe even for the uh, crafting of the fertilizer. You never know. So let's chop down a couple more of these. Let's take a look at how much wood do I have. 105 okay so that should do for a while we are gonna go ahead and craft those things grab these sticks this is then used once you are able to build this to capture the llamas and to just shear them without actually being forced to kill them so it looks like we are gonna be close to a harvest soon here so we're still gonna have to wait we have even some technical crops now growing so good stuff good stuff we have used all the fertilizer which we had so let's make sure that we have those planks let's go with 10 of them because we're gonna require more of them for the planters as well and of course, uh, once we acquire 1,800 or 1,500 gold, we're gonna try to 
make the space available for purchase and expand our overall production of whatever it is that we are up to. Okay, worms for bait. I need to make another chest, honestly, for just the crops and such. So let's see if we can find it. Okay, so we are gonna go and drop this off in here. And is this one where we keep the copper bars, the planks? Come on, play nice, play nice. Ooh, data disks. So we have one, so we can go to the research center, therefore. Uh, is there anything else which can be dropped off over in here? These, they are gonna be required for uh, the bridge. So over here we are able to dump the plant fiber. I should also consider dumping the soil or something. We need uh, salt in order to cook up the meat. But it's not actually the best thing for us because unfortunately it does not restore the uh, stamina. So there's that. And here we can go ahead and put down these things. So off to the research center. It's kind of far. I'm gonna have to make that run. Stamina depletes. We're gonna have to get a whole lot more copper in order to make uh, bronze bars because we're gonna require bronze uh, plates in order to build the bridge parts. So the, the bronze is gonna have to go into the cutters so that it is capable to be like sliced and diced. Hey, Hello. hey, 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 research. Hi. Did you discover something new? Give her five that data, disks. data disks. Still, if you want to expedite our research, you can submit more data disks. The more data, the faster we work. That's the data it. corruption on these disks are minimal. There should be useful info on them. We'll have something for you by tomorrow. So tomorrow in the mailbox, that's gonna be a thing. And we're gonna go into the mines to acquire the uh, copper and tin ore in order for us to be able to smelt those things. And also, we were able to acquire the blueprint for the better furnace. So, for the better furnace, we will require marble planks, uh, bronze plates, and also stone tools. So, yeah, there's, there's like quite a lot of stuff that needs to be done, like 15 tin ore. 16 pieces of copper just for 15 bronze bars. That will take a couple of days. And then we need those bronze plates. So that's going to take some time too. Marble plates too. But this thing uh, are, is able to turn out more bars at the same time simultaneously. So it's more efficient productivity. And therefore it's much better even if it might take a bit longer time it, it might be able to suck up more resources but it's gonna be awesome because we are gonna be able to just uh grind through the stuff and get what we need so we are gonna head into the mines and the uh, last time we were here i actually came across a decent spot where there were a bunch of artifacts and now that we can give to petra even like 10 data disks i might try to go there again and see if we can come across something but first we need to of course make sure that we have enough tin ore and enough copper and there was even a data disk in this raw resource don't ask me how it is possible. I'm still not sure how is it possible to come across this much copper just like that. I would assume that maybe there's some ancient ruin and may maybe there was like a power plant of sorts and the copper is now able to be extracted because it over time did stuff. I, I don't know, I'm not a geologist, so don't ask me. It's just like a chaos theory. So we're gonna see. I'm just gonna keep on mining here. I do not recall how much tin ore did it tell me to acquire, so I see that we have 20 now, 
Can I actually take a look? So handbook, uh, it took told us 15 tin ore and how much copper? 79, so we should be able to do this, but what I wanted to do is go over here. At least I think it was somewhere around these parts. Or was it? I don't think we are in the right section. No, we need to go the other way around. Right? Or was it somewhere down here? No. Yeah, I think it was somewhere around here. And there was like a hole already which we can follow. Come on. Do not disappoint me. There they are. Okay, let's make our way first to this one because it's the one most at the top. So that these tunnels have at least some sort of system to them. Ooh, nice. Another data disk. What is that? All thermos piece. Okay, interesting. Can then go after this one. So we're certainly gonna be able to make those bars. It's just gonna take some time. Joystick piece. Interesting, interesting. I would, however, be more appreciative if I would be able to fulfill at least one of the initial relics which we started to uncover because I'm sort of picking up uh, bits and pieces of everything else. Wrong key. Okay, there's one relic right over here. Word glass jar piece three, interesting stuff. And there should be something else. Anywhere else. This one is closer, so let's dig our way through this one. So, what is this? I think we already have this piece. But I cannot be too picky. So we'll take whatever we can. I don't know if there is a point for me to make another furnace, because we need to keep in mind that wood is right now being used to fuel them. And that's again the same piece, and I think we actually came across like the uh, rock through which we cannot go deeper. So, oh my god, what's the name of it in Minecraft? Someone has to remind me. Totally forgot the name right now. Wow, we are coming across lots of data disks just in the soil alone. That's awesome. Usually you have to like come across these chests and such. Oh wow, that's another relic, which we, I don't think, have too many pieces of. Which I'm not sure what to think of. So let's just keep on digging and digging and digging. So because we did manage to talk to Petra and get into the research center, uh, they're able to do whatever it is it's necessary for them to do so and tomorrow we should have the results of their hard work There seems to be another chest with another power crystal Okay, and now we need to make our way over there So at least with the uh, surplus of the wooden planks we should be able to I'll make more of the planters and plant whatever it is that we have. I still don't know if the pumpkin requires a certain season in order to grow. So that would be kind of important for me to probably find out next. And how do I get up top and closer to this relic? So let's keep on digging. So a chest with, okay, another data disc. If we would be able to get 10 of them though, that would be just awesome. Uh, I'm not really sure if that's gonna however be the case in here. I don't seem to be able to find more artifacts right now. Not at least in the vicinity of where we are currently located. So I don't know if I have extracted all of it. Let's try to get a bit more copper and tin ore. 
just because I don't feel like we have enough and I like to keep the furnaces going all the time and we are gonna have to get our hands on the upgrade kit for the tools so that we can upgrade both the axe and the pickaxe that way we can be cracking through larger stones and also chopping down larger trees which is gonna be uh really helpful for us any artifact okay there seems to be something deep 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 down come on i know it's there that's quite deep we have time we do have the stamina so let's keep on digging let's see what's gonna be down here if it's anything good this is not like in minecraft where you should not be digging beneath you so good stuff there there should be one more right so this one was the eyeglass. I don't know if we're gonna be able to use the eyeglasses for anything else. Maybe if we drop them off to the science lady, she's gonna be able to tell us. Or Petra's boss, or what you wanna call her. Okay. We'll prove that just digging a massive hole deep down is a bad idea. Is there anything else? There seems to be one more. 20 something meters away still have the energy so let's keep on digging please be something good i really would like to finish off at least one of the monuments honestly uh, that's another duplicate piece it stinks this is total bs not remembered how the heck to get to the chest over up there maybe if I would be able to ask the big fella to give me a boost because I, I just don't think jumping up here is gonna do the trick and we don't know how to do parkour parkour maybe if I would be able to jump up through here and here and here and here and uh here <laughs> there you go another talisman I should be selling those is there any wood we're gonna need wood for fuel purposes Let's grab all of these resources. Let's do this. We still have some energy left. I'm really hoping that from the crops, which we are going to be able to grow here, um, we are going to be able to mill our own wheat or wheat flour and uh, make our own bread because bread is so far the only recipe which I have discovered that is able to give me uh, stamina points. The other stuff, not really helpful that much. So you can see how many duplicates we have already. Like we have three pieces of this stuff. The sun is new, that's definitely new. Uh, we have another lens. What else? These things are new. So I'm gonna have to store them in this chest. Here we can dump the sand, we can dump the stone, we can dump the soil if I would have the space. The honey, the land fiber. Let's dump the wood. We have eight discs. If I can get two more, we are golden. And I want to know if I can actually make... Uh, refuel. Refuel. And now I'm out of wood, but we should be able to make... 
where are they? Uh, small planters. Three of them. Yep. Awesome. Uh, so... Let's take those and put them over here. And... Unfortunately, we do not have the fertilizer anymore. So that that's unfortunate. Am I able to put it over here? Awesome. And the seeds. We can go with three weeds. Uh, so let's let's do that. These are gonna take some time. They don't have any fertilizer. I don't know if I need to water them or something. I don't see like a watering can in here. You know? Herbal mixture, simple ointment, herbal juice, uh, chrysanthemum or something, animal bones. No, I got nothing. Crab box, wooden board and springs. We still don't know how to make springs. And bronze axe and these things are gonna require upgrade kits. Uh, which makes me think maybe eventually we should make more uh, of bronze bars uh, this thing is gonna go for four more hours this is gonna go for two more hours for this one last one so you know what let's switch it immediately to ten of these since we did refuel oh fudge we're gonna need more fuel huh still have six points of energy Another proof that we require more food in order to function. A bit better. A bit longer. So let's see if with this we are able to reignite the furnace. No, no, this one is good this one needs more wood so now we have the wooden planks so we can drop off these things oh uh, my god we're gonna need more of them two more in order to fulfill the quest so I kind of did screw up here about do not fear max is here we're gonna fix it hopefully fingers crossed uh, what else? What else? Uh, we need this over here. Tin ore over here, and this is the basic wood, which we do not have much of. So, I'm gonna have to go to sleep. It's past 1 a.m. already, so we are gonna get the warning that we should go to sleep. Anyhow. And... Abandoned runes is about to expire. Okay, and in two days we have the fishing event thingy going on. I would like to still get two more data discs, to be perfectly honest, but I'm not sure how to guarantee that exactly to happen. Also, I'm not really sure how to get uh, fertilizer. Let's see, what do we get from Petra? Uh, hello, we found something useful in the data desk you brought in yesterday. There's a lot of information for us to go through. We'll mail you the results within two days. That's awesome. Well, not really. At least the crops are done. Okay, uh, so they're gonna be done today. These ones are gonna still take... Three days... Three days, two days, so cotton takes a whole lot of time, which is unfortunate. We need to get salt in order to cook up all this lovely, lovely meat, and I don't know where to get the salt. So what is it that I should try to focus my attention towards right now? I don't know what do I need this thing, water tank for. Uh, simple water tank for holding water, you can see this everywhere. Let's 
stone brick and wooden board so we would require wood in order to make more uh, of those I'm gonna have to go somewhere and chop down some tree or a bunch of trees so this place has a nice population of something choppable call me El Chapo we're gonna be chopping and chopping and chopping so hopefully we're gonna get plenty of resources out of this although I think if we would be chopping down larger trees we can even come across that hardwood which we're gonna require for some of those blueprints later on and such and I should also take a look at those DM commissions because I have kind of been screwing around and commissions can yield you are uh, points with the community where you are able to gain experience, reputation, and start being a uh, like respectable business. And I don't know if we have right now a skill point to uh, invest into us. I'm trying to get as much of this stuff as possible so that it will keep on respawning over time. 1000 XP, that surely is nice. So let's see what can be done with this. We're gonna leave it at that. Look at all these ducks and chickens! Oh my god! You can pick up! Oh my god! I'm gonna steal! <laughs> wow, they are actually aggressive! Can I pick up a duck? Duck, 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 goose. There's a chest. And there's some gold hidden within. Let's go see if uh, at Sophie's farm we can actually purchase the salt. Cause I got honestly zero idea where we can get the stuff. Oh, uh, salt. Okay, so let's buy. Ten of them? We're still gonna be able to afford to go into the mines, uh, even if we have to uh, repurchase the permit for mining, is what I'm trying to say. So let's run home, let's cook up at least some of this steak. We still have not caught any fish, which is kind of unfortunate. There are some good fishing spots. There goes Arlo. So let's start cooking up some stuff over here. Ah, just so that we have something to work with. So it was either, okay, water tan, uh, we require, I know now, more planks, right? So let's get that going. And we are gonna require quite a lot of these. So bronze plates are gonna be the next thing which we need to do. Uh, marble planks, bronze bars. Already at max, and what can we do over here? Yeah, let's go for them. And I really need to find out if I need to water the crops or not. And also, I don't know if during the time when we are waiting for the ladies to uh, hand over the results of the research, if I can come over there and hand them even more data disks. So we might have to find out today. So we 
still have access. But I'm assuming tomorrow we won't have. And are there any relics for us? So what would it cost for me to maybe go to a different floor? Do you want to spend 20 gold to switch to another area of the abandoned ruins? Yes. I know it's kind of stupid on the last day of having access to the place, but due, due to the fact that we are looking for relics specifically, it might be a bit more profitable venture that way. So two data disks would be amazing. Or any of those uh, pieces of artifacts which we are trying to finish off. And there's another fan. I really need to check if I will be able to sell all these fans. If I will be able to start selling fans, that would be awesome. Because I'm quite sure we can turn some profit from that. Okay, data disk, another one of those books. I'm gonna have to ask about those books. I think this is like the second one which we have acquired this way. that wasn't there something closer yeah so let's dig our way to another relic oh what's that uh, I think we already have that one that's most unfortunate is this the only one that's closest to us it seems so that's unfortunate I don't want to waste all of my energy here today. We should try to do some fishing or something. And also we should be able to drop off the crops and see what's gonna be the reward for that. Okay, so 10 data disks. Goal achieved. And I'm gonna take a look if I can actually sell the damn fan. Or if we can drop off the additional 10 data disks to Petra. So there's multiple stops on the way. Hey, can I hop on you, Spencer? Apparently, no. We're gonna have to probably get our own horse eventually. If that's even possible. I'm not sure. I, I never finished the game or got like really really far like i think at certain point i was quite far enough like i had uncovered a, a large portion of the map but due to some reason i stopped playing it because either the game got somewhat repetitive or it was at some dead end spot from which i saw no way further or i wasn't really sure <clears throat> so, what can we do here? Uh, to receive one additional relationship points when chatting, when gifting. Let's go with this. This is gonna at least force me to start picking up the commissions. Let's see if we can sell the fan. Wow, really? So we're gonna be selling those. That That's... Uh, I have to ask regarding these books, the lovely, lovely ladies. So let's head inside and see if we can trigger Petra Hi. to do more research. We're still studying the data disks you provided. Should have something soon. Uh... And what about the book? Can we talk to Merlin? Um... If you find anything of value from the old world, please donate it to us. You have no idea how much discovery can change the world. Don't listen to what the church has to say. We just want to progress towards better worlds. Uh, can I give you this thing? Uh, so it seems to have worked. And maybe we can give one to Petra. So it seems to work. Okay. 
And here is the proof of concept that we still do not have plenty of these things. I think we are missing the thinking can piece. We have like the thinking can piece four, two, three. From the galloping horse, I think we have only the head. We don't have the horse piece four. From here, we have only one of these sons. And from this, we have only one part of the joystick. So not good, not good. We definitely need to get more of these things. And uh, we will require or acquire some experience out of that. Okay. So what do we get if we talk to Mars? Hi. Umbrellas are important. Good to see you. I've got a problem here. You see, recently folks have been buying up a lot of umbrellas, and now I'm short on stock. I'm gonna try to make some, but, well, I need materials. What type of materials? Nothing out of this world. Just some spines from the sea urchins you see lazing around the town. Do you think you can give me a hand? Yeah, sure. Great. Remember, though, only the tougher-looking urchins drop the spines as loot. Noted. And how many of the spines do we need? And how many days do we have for this? Okay, so it looks like we will get a blueprint for umbrellas. Fixing defense, we still have 11 days. There's no time limit on this. And once we harvest this, we need to talk to... Uh, what's her name? Yeah, I'm doing the same thing the game is doing because they do not know how to pronounce these names which you can put there and some people are a-holes and they just put in like the, the dumbest names. Some of them are highly creative though. Okay, Emily, Emily, Emily. Can we harvest these things and show them to Emily? Uh... Oh, come on! That's... That's ridiculous. Can we make more of the roasted meat? And how many of the boards do we have? Because we need five. So if I do that... The fans... Those should be sold. This one, this one. We can drop this, this, whatever we can, we are gonna drop off. Okay. And we unfortunately still need more time for these. 15, 13, 10. So let's go pick up the wood. We're gonna talk to Emily. I don't know how much of these crops do I need to drop off to Emily in order <clears throat> for this to be done. Harvest. So we have 11 pieces of wheat. Wow, that's an excellent result. I'm a believer now. Can I please order three of these planter boxes? Thank you. So now we need to do that, and I need to take a look at how many of those spines do I have stored, or if I was stupid enough to... So we have two, which means we need more of them, and we know where exactly to get our hands on those. We can theoretically even try our luck in fishing. I should have dropped some of these resources, it's pointless for me to carve around the stone and the other stuff. And I should consider replanting something into... Oh, let's go with this one. And... Bam! Donezo! Really need to start making some fertilizer. If I would only remember how! Three of these, huh? We don't have an enough animal feces. Uh, a weird thing to say, but anything is possible on this channel. Let's put these over here. Right now, I don't know how to use them. Uh, 
we're gonna take a look if there's some poop. Is there some poop? El Pupo. Nothing, and I'm too weird. Again, as per usual. Let's go try and run into some of those urchins. We need eight more. So urchins are those things with those tiny umbrellas. Or parachutes or whatever it is that they are doing here. So let's try our luck. Nice critical. Uh, got them. And I should try some fishing too in order to at least figure out how the heck does the in-game mechanic work. So that when there are, is the event, eventually I'm not a total goofball. Coming in trying to fish for the first time ever though. And of course also the commissions. I'm kind of screwing around with the commissions. Ooh, seaweed. This one seems a bit tougher. Nice. Let's see if we can take down Big Kahuna. Holy fucksicle. So I need to do... This, and I need to start eating this. So definitely not yet ready to take on the big ones. But the smaller ones... Uh, should be doable. How many of these spines do we have? Eight, we need ten. It's kind of hard to try and take out the little ones when the big one is uh, uh, screwing around. How many? Nine. One more. There are some urchins over here along with the crabs. I need to be careful here to not end up in the water where we get reset again goes that spine. Let's try to push him away from the water. And these ones actually give us gold, so this is not the worst thing ever. It did accidentally hit the urchin, and now the big urchin is after me again. And more seaweed. Awesome. So now, let's try to look. It's 23... 29... I swear to god, there's some fishing spot along here. Still have 52 stamina points. We're gonna require animal poop in order to make more planters. The three ones are gonna go, however, to our lovely neighbor as a commission. So, fish. You need bait to attract fish. Damn it, so we need the worms, actually. Interesting stuff, though. <coughs> Place the bridge head. Yeah, we need to have those things constructed first. So I'm gonna have to actually carry both the bait and the fishing rod. Good to know. A proof that I should have done fishing way earlier. So tomorrow we can theoretically try to do two commissions. Drop off the wooden planks, drop off the planters if we're gonna either sacrifice our own or I don't know hard to tell it's gonna be probably easier for us to make new ones two days man the cotton takes forever to get done what if I just pick up this one and open up can I store the planter or not really put in inventory haha <laughs> so we can do that Awesome. So the planks are being made, bronze bars being done. Uh, you know what? I don't know how many planks do we have right now. Eleven. 
so... How do I separate this? Sort. Uh, we're gonna have to come up with something. So we will require five of these, we will require ten of these. These two are gonna be sold. This is gonna go over here. Seaweed can go over here. What can go in here? Meat has to go over here. I'm gonna need more salt in order to make more of these things. They did help, certainly, prevent me from dying. Uh, how many of those marble ones do we need? Let's refuel and let's start crafting marble plates. I don't know how many of them will I require, totally forgot. And uh, three of them, okay. And the bridge head will require two of those. So we will require actually hardwood plank, which is just a proof that we will require an upgrade for our axe. So there's a bunch of things which will have to be worked on. Okay, it's 2 a.m. I really need to keep an eye out on that. If this would be Stardew Valley. <laughs> okay. So calendar, on the next day we're gonna have the fishing event thingy. So we need to keep a close eye on that. We are soon gonna reach the 12th level. So we need the uh, planks or boards, we need the spines. So that's gonna be quite a lot of experience there just from that. Three of the planter boxes. But we need those animal feces in order to make it happen. Otherwise, I would have to sacrifice the ones that I have currently. And that is something which I'm not yet willing to do. So marble planks. And I know, I know, I said that one of these was going to be for something. And the other one of them is going to be for something else. But obviously that cannot happen. So... Here goes nothing. 10 data disks. Do we have the mail yet? No, so ladies are still researching whatever it is that they are researching, huh? Need to refuel this one. I don't know what I need uh, charcoal for. What's left from burning wood It is dark and smoldering. Are we still making these? We're still making these, 19 hours. Let's refuel even this one, so that in three hours and such we can do something else. How's our goal? 644, so we will have to spend 80 in order to regain access to the mines. We can sell the two fans. And I need to take a look at some animal poop. Okay, I do see some piles of them. Don't know if it's gonna be enough, and also uh, I should probably first drop off the wooden planks and after that start making. Ooh, potato fruit seeds. That sounds yum. Uh, after that, only try to make the planters because uh, the planters I don't think have a deadline. Do I even have the wooden planks on me? I do. So let's run off to one of our destinations. Which is this way. It's actually one of these ways which we were chopping down the trees. We're almost there, but I stopped because it was pointless for me to press forward. The palisade wall, which you see over there, that's it. And I think the uh, guy here is working there. Yeah, it seemed to be oh, interacting with him. Town as well. I just moved here a little while ago. Name's Audit. Interesting name. It's like that uh, sketch from K and P where where he was pronouncing Aaron's name A Aaron or something weird like that. Okay, uh, so this should be the Porsche tree farm. 
Oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, this tree farm will be back in business in no time. Come on, Aidit. Let's get busy. So now we are able to gain access to the woods. I'm not sure what uh, tree farm is currently closed. So there seems to be at least something over here. Mushrooms, that's new. And we can be kicking trees in order to get more stuff out of them. And of course we are gaining experience from that. I need to choose the right tree because right now we're getting the rubber fruit. So let's try an apple tree. And that looks like some old building which is not being used anymore. And I don't think we're getting anything out of here. Ah, oh, we did get some apples. Awesome. So this thing is probably right now locked. So after this, we can take a look at the planters to see if we are going to be able to... Yeah, this doesn't seem to be accessible right now. Can we gather these mushrooms or are they poisonous or something? They are nice and shiny, so that tells me we can pick them up. Though I'm not sure what's the purpose behind having them. Ooh, this is new. We haven't been here before. So there definitely used to be something, some sort of city or whatnot, but it looks like it's underwater. And the bridge is probably intentionally raised up because there might be something dangerous on the other side. We need to equip bait for the fishing rod, I forgot, I forgot, we need to go and grab the bait in order for us to do some fishing. Yeah, I don't think we can do anything over here right now, which is unfortunate. So, uh, 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 there's more mushrooms. So let's pick these up. And we're gonna have to start kicking some trees or doing some stuff in order to have more bait available for us so that we can participate in the event. I'm not really sure if I can actually like go in there and uh, just start uh, fishing without bait or be able to purchase more bait. Uh, so we're gonna have to keep a close eye on that. Like I said, I haven't played this thing in years. So we're gonna see how it's gonna turn out and if you guys like the series or not. Okay. So let's try to escape this place through here. Oh wow, there's an invisible wall. We're gonna have to actually go Come on, give me something good. You're not giving me anything good. You're giving me rubber fruit. I want some of those caterpillar thingies. I think these are all just these rubber fruit thingies. Maybe from here we're gonna get some honey? What was that? Ooh, wild cocoon, first one, finally. I just gathered 1000 experience for kicking fruits. Okay, so... We should have the necessary resources. Uh... Don't know how many of those flanks are okay. We should have enough. So I should be able to grab those two more planters. And see if we can drop them off. Ooh, there's a chest. Why did I not notice that one before? This one is not even that well hidden. Dried apple slices. That sounds yummy. Yummy. 
Okay, so the thing is, I don't know where she is currently. So it's gonna be a bit more trickier to find her in order to drop off those planters. Um, it's two more, right? So I should have three of them currently in my inventory, which is what she asked for. So these can be dropped off, this can be dropped off. Cocoons. Uh, we don't have mushrooms stored anywhere. Apples can be uh, consumed. I really want to take a look at this, if this thing can be planted. Uh, 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 uh. Wait, don't we have this somewhere else? Yes, we do. So where do we find our two people who have these commissions with us? There's the mayor. Uh, we're gonna need more salt in order to cook more meat. I want to sell those two fans. So that's a nice chunk of change. Here you go, your I knew reward. I could count on you. Now I can get some more umbrellas made before it rains again. There goes that. And uh, da, 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 if we can find... The other girl with the quest uh, for the three planters. I'm not really sure if there are more uh, boxes. I think might be there might be one over there in that tower. So let's go take a peek. Peek or two. Because you never know, exploration is rewarded. Yeah, I was correct. Such an obvious place to put it in. It, it took me so long to get in here. Three planters. We do have them. We do want to sell them. And we should take a look at the uh, commerce guilds to see if we can pick up one of these things. In order to get some decent commission. Hey, bud. Ooh, what's that? A D1. Uh, we at the church need eight charcoal. I hope a builder will help us soon. May Mother Earth watch over you. Okay, so this seems pretty damn uh, doable. So we're gonna accept that one. It's for five days. I need four bronze bars. Please help me fulfill this commission. We're unable to accept any more commissions. Okay, so we're gonna have to go make those charcoal thingies. So I'm going to have to abandon the bronze production, at least for a tiny bit. Where can I find her? Is she back at the farm? I think I see her running around there. Please don't go inside or something weird like that. Is she running my way towards my farm? I think she might be. So let's do this and... Thank you. I can't wait to try these <clears> out. <throat> And now the question is, how much money do I have? Because if we have 1,500... Damn it, I'm missing 60. If I would have enough, I would be able to expand the uh, land which we currently do have under our control. Um, so how much is it? The charcoal? Eight. So let's, let's cancel this, let's refuel this, and let's start making... Eight. Right? It's eight. Yeah, it's eight. It's gonna take seven hours, point something, something. So we should be okay with that. And I really need to go. And I really need to... Start fishing. Where's the bait? We have the bait. We can learn whatever is this. 
don't really know what I'm gonna do with an umbrella right now, to be perfectly honest. Cinnamon. Animal fat. Ooh, yum yum. Purple mixture, simple antidote. Resin. We're gonna have to get the uh, upgrade kits, but I first want to go into this. This expands the... Uh, I hope it's not just like this tiny space which I'm gonna get. That would be just too damn stupid. One day, one day, one day, two days, two days, two days, three days, Jesus. We need salt in order to cook up these things. We need to drop off this and... Let's go fishing, I guess. Let's go find a decent fishing spot. And let's see if we can catch some fish. That golden salmon sounds yummy. And there is uh, maybe a difference in the fish which we can catch over here by the river where that bridge is supposed to be built towards this Amber Island. I'm not really sure how this is gonna increase the tourist uh, population here because the island is just infested. But there are these giant crystal stones or rocks which can theoretically uh, fuel us. So when a fish bites, press the less left mouse button to reel it in line otherwise will this fish will swim away okay oh so there is a mini game with this so we need to keep the fish in the circle and you cannot uh increase the red bubble within the uh, white bubble because otherwise the fish would break free Oh my god, that's a big chungus. And there's a, a distance which is in the number which you need to clear out. Catfish. Man, if it would be this easy to get, catch catfish in Stardew Valley, huh? Are we gonna get two catfish? Catfish is one of the other fish which we can actually cook up in, on the grill. Uh, rusty iron pipe, we can sell that. That's good to know. We need the money. For lots of things, actually, surprisingly enough. Yeah, I'm gonna need to get more caterpillars. These little buggers. Frogfish. I'm gonna have to come up uh, with some sort of way of what the hell am I gonna do with those. Oh wow, this one is feisty one. Maybe better quality, bigger piece. Come on. We can try to go by the ocean. It's still not like even... How do I cancel this? Okay. Um, we have three more. So there are more fishing spots for us to find, of course. But for some reason we cannot swim. Ooh, there's even a chest on this island over here. Tempting. Ooh, what do we have here? Let's see if we can take more damage than we can dish out. And there goes that shell. So the shell can be used for another form of talisman. Nice critical there. Mucus, interesting stuff. I should stop taking this damage, right? Nice, lobster meat. Oh, what are those? Those look yummy. What the heck is that? Is that a rabbit? Illusion bunny, level 20. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. What do we have here? Some sort of sea fish. 
So let's see if we can get something decent out of here. This one seems to be fighting a bit. Golden Salmon! Okay, we have found the Golden Salmon. Still a, quite a distance for you to come in and be caught. I don't know how many more worms do we have, but it's past midnight as well, so I really need to return back home. So we need more bait. And there seems to be a shell. Noise. Seashell at the seashore. So let's run back home. We're gonna have to come up what to do with the frogfish. We can cook up the uh, salmons and the catfish, although right now I think it's only the catfish which is allowed to be cooked on the grill. Ooh, look at Moomoo's. Oh, you're so cute. And there is a big turd, which I'm gonna take for science purposes and get pumpkin seeds out of it. You never know. You never know. Don't judge me. So if we are able to fulfill the commission and drop that off, we are able to take another commission and drop off those bars, which would give us another quick fix or a quick reward, which would be awesome. Uh, we need salt in order to cook these, right? Yeah, catfish and such. Looks like almost all of the charcoal is done. So that's awesome. And the, 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 we're gonna drop off these. I don't know, we can maybe refuel. And I really need to head to bed in order to not end up sleeping with the fishes. With the fish. This fishes doesn't exist in English language or something weird like that, right? It's just fish, even for plural, I think. Not sure right now. Don't quote me on that. Rusty pipe. Rusty pipe can be sold. Good to know. Good to know. I really wish these other pieces would be able to be sold as well. And now without the bait, I think the fishing event is starting. That's gonna be fun. I also don't know if I will be able to drop off these things due to the event specifically. Because if everyone is participating in the fishing day... Uh, let's do this. Uh, 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 uh. So we have three days and something, so... I'm not sure if I will be able to drop these things off. So this is when the event is starting from 8 till 3. I don't know if I will be able to... Uh, Participate without bait. It's gonna be kind of a problem. So let's go grab that last piece of charcoal. And this thing. And what would be the next thing which we should start making? Let's go for 10 of these. We never have enough of those. And... Fuel. Let's get some glass. We never know when we might need some glass. Uh, how about our crops? Zero days, zero days, zero days. So these three are going to be done at the same time. And there's still plenty of time for these. But we will require that fertilizer and such. Okay, reward for the research, right? Research results. Hello, we've completed the research into diagram. Here's the result. Blender. Interesting. We're going to take a look. Town Hall. The 19th of this month is the day of the bright sun. To celebrate, please prepare a present for the town and give it to Mayor Gale before the 18th. On the day of the holiday, we will throw the presents from our airship. Thank you, Porsche government. Interesting. <clears throat> so from 8, the event is happening and I think it's around here, right? So we're going to see if we can participate without having any bait, which is highly questionable. 
Maybe we will be able to afford some. We do have the money for it. Uh huh. So let's make our way there because it starts now. Do I have free? Yeah, we do have free space in our backpack. So it's down over there. I'm not sure if you can see it uh, at the distance. Ooh, poop. Ooh, more poop. There's where the attention spam of a goldfish comes in handy. But I keep my focus. So for the next few days, I'm not really sure if we can do more research or drop off more CDs or do just about anything. And that makes me also kind of worried as, uh, well, the event lasts only until three. So it's gonna be interesting. Let's see if we can participate. Maybe I will have to purchase some bait or something. So, uh, ooh, we can actually drop off the charcoal. Okay. And Mayor Gill. Um, chat? I'm actually a pretty good fisherman myself, you know. I hope everyone has fun today. See you. Uh, where do I sign in? Interesting stuff. So we can receive some points. And have like a proper outfit. Goddamn. Plus defense, plus stamina. These are some nice buffs. Gift exchange, 10,000 gold. Okay, interesting stuff. How do I sign in, though? McDonald's. Hi. Did you just arrive at our town? You might have heard of me. I'm famous around these parts. Um. Wow, look at that big one. Yeah, I need some sort of bait. Participate. Ah. Uh... No. Seriously? Is there no way for me to purchase bait? No. Let me participate or buy stuff or something. I'm gonna kill myself. Literally, I, I cannot participate in the event because I do not have the caterpillars. There's some cocoons, some honey, and some other stuff. This is gonna kill me. Why did I do the fishing yesterday? Okay, hold on. Is there a way for me to acquire... Caterpillars. You can buy them at Sophie's Ranch. Uh, should I restart the day and try to do this again? You know what? Let's let's do that. So we're gonna have to go through the mail and everything else. We're gonna have to drop off the charcoal. But the best thing is I should be able to purchase a bunch of bait and be able to do this fishing. So let's pick up these. Let's make glass and more. Peace. There's that. Uh, 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 uh. So let's go buy those things after we read the mail. So it's the same thing, right? Seems to be the same thing. Blender. We're gonna have to take a look at Blender. Uh, I think Blender is used for getting us some of these uh, antidotes and whatnot. I'm not sure right now. Is Blender over here? 
need to go at the end. Blender. So we need teeth, we need car uh, carbon steel bars, so iron ore and charcoal. Yeah, so this thing, I'm not really sure what does it even do if it makes like concrete or something happen. So let's go purchase the uh, bait. We do have the money. And after the event, we're gonna get like, I don't know, 40? Uh, after the event, we can sell the fans, we can sell the pipes. Come on, it's, it's like in three seconds. It would be the worst thing ever if I would not be able to enter the store. Why, why can't I see the bait? Okay, there you go. Ah, this is gonna cost me a whole lot of gold, huh? Let's go with 50. This way we have plenty of room to work with. Ooh, we can get fertilizer. I wanna get fertilizer. So let's get that. We're gonna be able to make some money anyhow. Uh, bamboo papaya seed. Uh, season summer. Yeah, so spring and summer is for pumpkins. Awesome. Lettuce is for spring and autumn. Spring and autumn. All seasons for the wheat. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. And uh, potato fruit seed for all seasons. Awesome. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. So let's go participate in the event. And I know I should not be doing things like that, but hey, what the heck. At least the wiki is helping me out. It's not as good as Stardew Valley wiki, but it's still better than being poked in the eye with something. So I'll take it any day, if you know what I mean. Oh, damn it, I should have bought the damn salt, right? I'm an idiot. Uh, apply fertilizer. Apply fertilizer. Apply fertilizer. Apply fertilizer. And apply. And apply. And apply. And I have burned through most of my fertilizer. Still don't know if this wooden sword has been a good investment, though. So we should have the charcoal. We have the charcoal. Awesome stuff. We're gonna be able to fulfill that commission and in the afternoon if Petra is gonna be at the research center, I'm gonna try to give them 10 data disks and that's gonna hopefully get us some decent research. Hopefully. Anything is possible. With the 50 baits, uh, we should be able to do quite a lot of fishing here. And that big fish can actually be caught even on the beginner's fishing rod, but of course, that is a difficult thing to pull off. So let's go find uh, our commission. So there you Hi. go. Commerce commission. So there's that. And uh, we can go talk to Mayor Hello. just because. I'm actually a pretty good fisherman myself, you know. I don't think I have anything for you right now. So let's see if we can participate and catch that big one right over there. Pay 200 gold entrance fee to join the tournament. Will cost 3 hours and 15 stamina points. This is kind of pricey, huh? So let's see how good we are gonna be. Okay, we're starting off strong with frogfish. Emperor frogfish. Interesting. I would like to see that big one reeled in. Bannerfish. So we have quite the point advantage versus our competitors right now. So let's try to keep that up. I don't know if the uh, num numbers of bait which I have caught is gonna, however, cut it. Emperor Catfish, noise. Come on, I wanna catch the big guy. What is this one? Emperor Lanternfish. I didn't even 
even see that fish in that pile of fish. Okay, another Emperor Frogfish. Really hoping that out of those 10 data disks, we are gonna get something really decent. Oh wow, you're a feisty one, huh? I don't even know what you are. Emperor Bladefish. I wanna catch that big one. Let me catch that big one. I don't care if it's gonna take half an hour to reel it in. I wanna try and catch the big one. I'm a sucker for the big one. Oh my god, this thing has a freaking horn. I'm trying to catch unicorn fish. Gladiator fish. Okay, that's a different name. I don't know where I will be, however, able to sell the fish for money. Or if I'm able to, like, I don't know, make um, a fish tank with these as a decoration or something. We're gonna have to stop by at the shop and purchase some salt for cooking and also more bait. Bubble fish. Bubble fish for 100 gold. Oh my god, it's the big one! Holy fudge. Why are you so difficult? Stop squirming around. I have to be careful because just a tiny bite or click and uh, we are really in the danger zone here. But I'm gonna reel you in no matter what. I have reeled in bigger things. Goliath! Nice. Really nice. I think we are the most proficient fisherman out of the bunch. What are you, you little bugger? You are a kind of feisty one, aren't you? Okay, results. Amper frogfish. Okay, banner fish. Okay, frogfish. Emperor catfish. Emperor lantern fish. Emperor frogfish. Emperor bladefish. How much for Goliath? How is it possible for a freaking Goliath which weighs 27 freaking kilos? We get less than for a freaking tiny frogfish. So, Max, what do we get? Uh, fisherman badge. Uh, bacon fish roll. Creamy salmon stew. Spicy fish soup. Nice. Really nice. And can I exchange those points for whatever? 25. How many do I freaking have? We have 10? Uh, so we need like 25, 40, 50. That's a lot of them. Can we participate one more time? Ah, sure. We have the money. We have the bait. And I'm gonna try to sell things after the event in order to make more money. Because if this thing will cost me 400 gold, and then there's the price for the bait, of course. Although I'm not really sure if I will need that much more bait, to be perfectly honest. I'm gonna have to take a look. And how much bait did I consume on the event? So we know that we went here with 50 of them. And based on the remaining number, I'm gonna know how many more to obtain. Am I gonna get the Emperor one? No, just the basic one, huh? Oh, at least we're getting some experience out of this. Ah, Goliath. Here we go again. My old nemesis. The big one. The big hungry one. You're not getting free. What do you think? This is not the first game where I'm trying to catch some difficult species of fish. Come on. Almost got you. Ha <laughs> ha! There we go. You bastard. Here's the little cute thing. Firefish. Interesting, eh? Oh, we haven't caught bladefish yet. How is it possible that I'm learning the name of the fish faster than the names of the people in this game? There's something really wrong with me. Ooh, golden salmon, huh? Ooh, 
Emperor. Nice. I'm running. Is that a koi car? Oh my god, how is it possible we're able to catch koi carp? Banner fish. So 400 gold to participate twice. Maybe I will not do that two times. I'm actually glad that we have had so much money. <laughs> I would be totally screwed. Oh wow. What is this little one? Bubblefish. Bubblefish almost got away. That would have been weird. Okay, we still have like 15 or 16 seconds, so let's reel in the catfish. I don't think we're gonna be able to reel in anything else. Okay, that was unfortunate. Am I gonna be given time to reel in the bladefish or no? It looks like no. So I think we did not achieve as much of a score called less emperor species. But we still managed to conquer another Goliath. So awesome. Another set of these dishes. Really nice. And I think that's the end of the event. Uh... Oh my god, I have all the fish still. 20 of these. I, I don't think I can actually uh, purchase even the freaking hat. Max HP plus 150. That would be actually really nice. Uh, we have 20. Uh, if we would be able to participate twice tomorrow, we should be able to get this. So plus 80 and plus 30 to stamina. Fisherman's shirt, level 12. I can do that. Uh, now I have to figure out what the hell am I gonna do with all the fish. If I can sell the fish, I'm happy. If not, I'm miserable. And we have gone through 31? Yeah, 31 bait. So if I would get like 30 bait, we should be A-OK. -okay. Uh, now the question is if I can find Petra and give her the data disks. No. Hi. So they're gonna probably have to return into the town in order for us to do anything. And I need to figure out where the heck to drop off all the fish. Are they all running after the bus? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, so you see those stones over there? Those should be the ones which I think contain the power crystals. Which if you have the copper uh, pickaxe, you are able to uh, mine. And get them. Okay, so they're running into the village. I would love to see Petra get inside the research center so that we can hopefully give her the 10 data disks, which would help me out tremendously. The question is if I enter, if they're gonna be inside already or not yet. It looks like Merlin has not participated. And we can exchange data disks for some stuff here. A weapon rack. Learn to craft the weapon rack with the advanced composite board, honeybee wax. Uh, training dummy. Learn to craft the training dummy with the steel plate, hardwood plank, rope, and such. I'd actually love to give Petra the 10 data disks. And we need to start somehow finishing off these things. But if I'm gonna spend 400 gold tomorrow, I really need to find a place where to sell all the fish. Where's Petra? Am I gonna be kicked out of the place because it's past six? I don't think I'm gonna be able to return here today. So this is really unfortunate. Yeah, it's only uh, open till six. Petra didn't return here, and I don't know if I can sell the fish to this shop. So let's do just that. We're actually getting some decent 
sum of money. God damn. I don't have any more money spent today. Can we sell the pipes? Aw, oh, man. And we cannot sell the fish to you. That sucks. I would love to get these. So we are actually able to, if I will be able to sell more gold or more fish. So we're going to try to squeeze him dry for everything. It's going to be super helpful. Because we can theoretically upgrade the tools. So he doesn't have the money, unfortunately. Uh, here's the thing, it's, it's 1,500 for the expansion of our farm, we would be left with 500 something gold, I would need 400 to participate in the event twice in order to get my hands on the reward which I have my eyes out for. Can I actually apply more fertilizer on these crops? Can we actually harvest these or not yet? Uh, so these are gonna be done and we can therefore consider dropping the... One day, one day... gonna be done this is gonna be something the glass is being done ah oh, marble planks we need more of that we need stone stew we need the bronze plates I don't know if we can make bronze plates five of those so let's start making those that's gonna take you quite a while it's gonna be done by tomorrow be able to take the glass, the, the copper bars. Now if I would only remember where is what, right? Okay, and the question is, can we upgrade? Yes, we can, because we have... So let's make that, and let's make this. So now we have these better tools, which means I can theoretically run to one of these trees. Haha, <laughs> there we go. We might actually be able to acquire some hardwood out of this thing. We can even go through the stomp. And we are acquiring hardwood now. And I think hardwood was part of one of those blueprints which we need to get for some purpose. Bird nest! What am I gonna do with a bird nest? And because we picked up the commission, I'm gonna have to go into the town and pick up another commission. Okay. Nice. We're gonna need the wood for the fuel, of course. And for some other crafting purposes. Are you two done? Ah, uh, like two hours point something, huh? Bird nest. Ah, uh, that's, uh, that's interesting. I should try to make one more planter and try to plant those weird apple thingies. That would be actually nice filling that gap. Oh, this is the wrong one. What am I missing? Wooden boards. Okay. That's unfortunate. 
We still have some time. Ooh, you know what? We can try to break through those larger stones. Maybe we'll get those uh, marble pieces so that we have those marble plank thingies. And there you go. That's that marble. Since we have the energy and time to spare. Uh, I don't know what's this, but we're going to have to pick it up or come back for it. I still need to be get a bigger one. Kidding me, right? How about this one? Give Gale the day of the bright sun gift. Not really sure what to give him though. Uh so let's let's consult with the wiki. And I don't know. What what's it called? Uh Day of Bright. Day of Bright. Day of Bright Sun. The Day of the Bright Sun is a festival to celebrate the event of Peach ending the 330 year long age of darkness by clearing the clouds and letting the sun rays shine over the land once again, which occurs around 100 years prior to the events of the game. It occurs on the 19th day of month one, year one. And the uh, uh, festivities during the first year at the Fairside meeting on the 14th, Mayor Gale requests that all citizens of Porsche participate in the gift giving event by donating an item. The builder can participate in this through present for the celebration mission. Okay, let's open that up. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's something which I should be able to give or consider giving tips emperor fish make great gifts make emperor fish can caught during fish day competition uh more so than usual prior to the event upgrade skills relevant to endurance including recovery rate and amount of endurance consumed okay so at least i know that i'm gonna donate the a uh, goliath fish no emperor fish emperor fish so emperor golden salmon so we're gonna keep that dude and we're gonna sell the rest of them. Oh, uh, I'm gonna need some salt, some more bait. We're gonna see how that's gonna work out for us. We need more wooden planks. Are you two done? Come on. Marble. Or something. Oh, let's do, drop these off. Let's drop these off. Do we have any bars or something weird like that? Does it seem like so? Ooh, resin. Nice. So this can go here. This can go here. We have now these. Hardwoods. Art what we're gonna need to get rid of that and we need 20 more of these in order to get that jacket it's gonna be driving me up the wall that for like a whole year we cannot really do anything restores max stamina uh, restores max HP and adds buffs okay nice so we can theoretically sell the bacon fish roll that sounds disgusting my god what is wrong with you so all these fish, theoretically we can keep the catfish for cooking. Although we have like a crap ton of meat to burn through. But whatever. Uh, 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 uh. Almost done. So let's grab those seeds. We know that we can do pumpkins, but I want to do one of these and I want to do one of these. And I don't think I have enough fertilizer because I have spent it all, so I'm gonna have to purchase more. 
but I'm not sure if I want to be buying this right now. We're gonna probably save that for the afternoon. Harvest and harvest. And we are gonna we are gonna plant this and this. Ta-da! Nice. Uh, you know what? Let's let's take the salmon. We're gonna sell the salmon. Let's drop off this. We have plenty of wheat. Ground into flour to make bread and other foods. Awesome. That is awesome. Because bread recovers stamina, so I'm happy about that. Is there anything else, or should I go to bed? just most likely call it quits. Ah, uh, we need that salt and the other stuff, so... Where did I drop off the glass? Anyone? Oh, okay. Let's just go to sleep, and tomorrow we're gonna participate in the second day of the event. I'm gonna grab something to drink and hydrate because all this talking is challenging. Let, let's call it that. Oh, wow, okay, so he actually got out of the bed on his own. Okay, fun stuff, fun stuff. Did not see that coming, did not see that coming. I thought I have some time here. Alrighty. So we have this, and now we can actually start making... Why can we make only so few? I'm gonna have to switch eventually to making the hardwood ones, huh? That's interesting. Uh, we have plenty of these now, that's awesome. But yeah, probably the reason behind is that I have one piece of wood. Or maybe that's the reason. Okay, so we need to go see Grandma, and we need to go and purchase salt. We need to purchase maybe more seeds, definitely the fertilizer. This is why I'm trying to uh, not spend my money right now, and only spend it after the event. I don't know if there isn't a actual thing. Okay, so he is actually able to sell us animals and even meat. It's, it's kind of funny how you call this chicken and this is a chick. Okay, so he only sells calves and lambs and the baby versions of everything. And it doesn't look like he purchases anything. You bastard. Okay, so it's eight. Is there something on top of this house by that weird windmill? Can I climb in through here? Yeah, of course there is a chest. Haha! <laughs> Dried apple slices. I should really look into those apple slices. So we need like 30 pieces of bait at least. Ah, uh, da, 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 da. so. 30. Or let's go with 31 so that we are back at our 50. And. I don't know. Let's grab like 20 of those. And we can actually sell these. And she has quite a lot of cash. So let's take it all from Grandma. Salt. Almost forgot. Let's grab like 20. Flour. Or rice. Ooh. So not native to the land. Tito fruits. Uh, summer bamboo papaya. Uh, well, let's do that during summer if we get there. Uh, let's see. Uh, potato fruit seeds. Small planter box. Ah, let's grab like I don't know ten. Maybe ten. 
Maybe 10? 10? Okay. And with more Emperor fish, which we might be able to catch. Who knows what's gonna happen. So how much how much money do I have left? We need 400 in order to participate in the shindig. Okay, we have 2,500 something something. And hopefully we're gonna be able to pick up another quest. Or commission, should I say, sorry. So let's go participate in the shindig. It's gonna take us a while to get there. Especially with our stamina being what it is. I really wish like there would be a way for me to dash endurance. Uh, 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 maximum health, defense, damage increases. That sounds awesome too. Uh, tree kicking and harvesting activities have a six percent chance to double the loot noise. I however think we're gonna go for more of this fun stuff. Or did I actually spend point for the dash? I, I think I might have accidentally spent a point for the dash. Well, that's unfortunate. But never mind. You do not fear. Max is near and he's gonna screw up something again. So let's go. Let's pick up these things. Ooh, bamboo papaya seed. <laughs> I just saved a bunch of money on that. But we will have to wait for the summer season, unfortunately. Can't wait for summer to be here again, huh? Who can relate? It's almost September, god darn it. Although I'm not really sure when the episode will be uploaded, so it might be September. Anything is possible with me and my word. How did you get over there? There's no bridge. How did you get over there? Explain yourself. What is that? He's cheating. That's not fair. That should not be allowed. How did your bro get across the pond? Yeah, let's pay for this shindig. We want to win it, and we want to get that uh, outfit. Some catfish. That's one. Let's stop wasting time. We have only two points, and already someone is ahead of us. So we need to roll up our sleeves and do that fishing shindig. Okay, it's starting to get a bit more trickier today. Ooh, that's a new species. I haven't had that. Is that some sort of needle fish or something? What is that? Blue mackerel! Noise! Interesting stuff. Come on, give me something good. I know you- Oh, wow. This one is like that- that- Ooh, damn. This has to be that royal one. I have to be careful here, otherwise I'm gonna lose this bugger, and I don't want to do that. I'm hoping I'm gonna get some decent reward for it. For it. Come on. Almost. Noise! Gladiator Fish King! $5,000! Are you kidding me? I think that just single-handedly handed us the victory. How fun! Come on, Goliath, I know you are hungry for me to put you on a wall or fry you up. Don't know how gladiator fish or, or any of these other species would taste, but that big one, I think that would be a nice meal. So that one fish guaranteed us a victory. I'm really sure that should be a thing, but... Hey, I'm not gonna complain. There we go with the Goliath. This old bastard. I'm not gonna give up. And I'm not gonna give up. None of us are gonna give up. A true battle. I was getting too cocky, and that is what happened. Really sensitive mouse. I'm actually uh, surprised I did not lose more fish as of yet. Still have 45 or 6 seconds. Oh wow, that's new. I haven't seen that yet. Oh, someone actually called the Goliath. Son of a gun. Emperor Wise Fish. Looks a little weird, but okay. What do I know about being wise, right? Trying to turn this into living. <laughs>
Okay, another blue macro. Five seconds, you go. And that's an Emperor one. And that's it. 591. And all thanks to the Gladiator Golden Fish. Damn! Damn, 156 for 47 kilogram fish. Jesus Christ. Okay. That's a big one. Oh my god, I can't actually. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. No, cancel. We want to participate in this shindig. Oh man, I I should have dropped off the uh, seeds and everything. Now I have all this fish over here. I'm gonna have to come back for all this fish. I'm gonna have to sell or purchase that land. Is this some sort of emperor version? Why is it all so weird? And the uh, no, it's just normal blue mackerel. What a ripoff! Ah, there we go. This bastard. You're not getting away. Not this time. Problem is, you don't get as many points for the Goliath as you would get for that one bugger which I caught just previously. Ah, that fish was worth 5,000 gold. Oh, come on! Don't be so sensitive. Goddamn Corsair mouse. Or maybe I'm too eager. Who knows? But we are... Oh my god, we are last! I really need to step up my freaking game. That bear is killing it! That's not funny! Let's see if we can reel in as many of these burgers as I can. Still have like almost two minutes. Come on! Nice. Okay, this, this fast reeling in uh, strategy might work, but might also kick me into two sheep. But the bear has like twice as many points, so I need to really step up my game. If I would be able to acquire one of those big ones or super rare ones again, I cannot lose this little thingy. Wise fish. Blade fish. Trying to rule it in as much as possible. Trying to catch as many fish as possible. I, I don't think we're gonna acquire first place this time. That bear is killing it! God damn, look at that bastard. I bet he's cheating. He has something in his uh, bathroom hiding some extra bait or something. Come on, frog fishy. 40 seconds to go. If I don't catch something super rare, I'm screwed. I think we're gonna be on second place. But the problem is the Goliath does not even give you as much points as you would like them to. It's just more like a nuisance. So screw it. I don't care. Late fish. Yeah, he has 200 points advantage or... Yeah, that's this gonna be second place this time, which sucks! Oh man, this sucks, this sucks. Uh, problem is... I don't get enough points to acquire the damn piece which I wanted to get. Can we participate now? This ends now. So I need to come back for all the fish. Ah, rusty iron pipe. Awesome. What I can theoretically do is increase my backpack storage in order to get all the fish. And then we're just gonna be selling it off for the highest bidder or whoever can afford all this stuff. Because I don't know how much Granny has money left at the farm. Uh, McDonald doesn't buy anything. No, cancel. Uh, so I'm gonna have to run back here. Uh, wait, hold on. Let's do this. Let's do this. Uh, we have the gold. So this one is 600. This one is 900. I think I just acquired all the fish. 
Oh, if I would have some honey, I would give it to the winner, but no such luck. So now the question is, uh, can I sell the fish to someone? I would really love it if I can Hi. give Petra the discs, but we're gonna have to wait until tomorrow for that to happen. So let's run into the town square and try to sell as much of this as we can. Because I will require the money for re-entering the mines and also to um, increase the size of our farm. So we should have this one. This thing, oh my god, it costs really 5,000 gold. Damn. If I would have better social skills, maybe, be able to make more dough. Yeah, you know what, let's sell the catfish, I don't care. I'm losing money here. He has still plenty of gold to spend, so I'm gonna try to squeeze him dry. And I have to make sure that you, I have the, the correct freaking em tips. Emperor fish make great gifts. Many emperor fish can be caught during the fishing day. Prior to the event, upgrading skills relevant to endurance. Uh, before the day of the bright sun, I'm gonna have to look into that. Still has over 3,000 gold to hand over, so hand it over. I'm not joking, hand it over. 51. If I would be able to give this damn thing, that would be probably epic. Uh, so I have made real decent money here. Which means I should be able to afford that extension of our land. Hopefully it's gonna be a big one and it's not gonna be something ridiculously small and stupid. We're gonna be able to start cooking more stuff. I'm gonna have to chop down some more trees or something. I don't know how much fuel do I have even in this thing. Not too much, huh? Yeah, I sold all the catfish, that's true. So there goes that. Uh, we're gonna need to do stuff. Okay, so buy this. Surprise me. Yeah, okay. Gather. Gather. Pick up, move, and eventually we're gonna have like smelting location and uh, like other productions. I, I really cannot remove you or move you around. Seriously, come on, bub. Pick up. Uh, sure. you know now this looks just really freaking weird can harvest this and now I'm trying to figure out where to put the planters because I think if I would relocate them from back here to maybe like having them back here it would be much much nicer so maybe I can pick up the grinder or any of those other disgusting applications and move them around Wooden boards, awesome. So we're gonna pick you up. We do have the fertilizer, we do have the other stuff. I I really hate the fact that I cannot move you around. Maybe I will have to go into the uh, workshop. Not enough materials, we need wooden boards. We need wood. True that, true that. I'm gonna need also more wood for more storage. So let's go a bit crazy here. We have like plenty of energy right now. Damn it! Totally forgot to pick up. Uh, oh yeah, we don't even have enough of those points to me uh, to like pick up the damn shirt or something. 
Damn it, that bear totally screwed up the whole damn program for me. If I would be able to acquire that uh, hoodie or that jacket, at least, that would have been awesome. There goes that. So now we should have wood. Hopefully to refuel. Uh, bronze bars. Yes, please. We need more copper ores. We're gonna have to go into the damn mines. Just a proof. Refuel. More charcoal. Sure, let's get it done. And... Fertilizer. Right. Fertilizer. And we can go with these two potatoes. Potatoes, potatoes. And there you go. Let's give you a bit more fertilizer. That. And can we make that chest? No, because I don't have whatever. And so that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you did like it. I certainly did have fun playing it. So if you have any tips, advice, or things you would like me to try and showcase, let me know. That's what the comment section is for. For more fun content like this, consider subscribing. It's a published video on a weekly basis on all sorts of topics, games, playthroughs, and such. I will wish you a pleasant rest of the day. Hopefully I will see you all in the next one or in the comments. See you all there in the meantime, and bye-bye for now. These sandbox games do have something magical about them. Thank you.